Yo, what's good, Killer Squad? We're back on Madden Mobile, and this weekend, unfortunately, I was super duper busy, so I couldn't actually post many videos. If I did have one, it was pretty late at night. But there was these Legend Plus map bundles, Legend Plus packs that came out, which is absolutely really sick because I did kind of predict it. There was these draft packs that came out for the league versus a uh, league events, I guess, league packs, league. Uh, I forgot what it's called. But anyway, there was those. So I was like, it'd be cool if they dropped those type of packs in store. So I think apparently from these packs, there's a choice. To pick them i know the topper is one out of three elite legend players so i'm actually super hyped about that so guys let me know in the comments down below even though it's a little late what do you guys think about these packs are you guys hyped about it do you like it hopefully you guys will be able to get some next week um if you guys did open some let me know what you guys get so like over 200 likes also for this video so we do have a bundle that i saved up so that's what 10 packs and a topper so we'll see how it goes we're gonna open all of them cool thing about these packs we can open all of them and we'll save the topper at the end that's a cool feature also I forgot to mention cool feature in the game that you can actually select which packs you want to open and then put them in that order so it's a great for variety pack opening I'm super hyped I hope they do that in NBA Live Mobile that's gonna be really really lit so okay cool so first round you get to pick your collectibles so you get a bunch of gold players and you get ooh, mm, Mac mm, you got something in my mouth mm, mm, mm. anyway my bad Look, so we get to pick, so you get a bunch of free players, which is good, but then you get to pick a collectible. I'm probably going to pick one of the newer players. Um, Walter Joan, I believe, is new, and as well as Dan Marino. So we're going to go pick, I think we get two of them. Ooh, an Earl Campbell. I think he might be new as well. So we're going to pick those two. So this way, it's really cool. You get to get the player that you want, and you get to pick whoever you want. So that's going to be really good. They might be able to do, like, special fantasy draft packs like they do on the console. That would be absolutely amazing. I believe Eric Allen is a new one. Ooh, Lawrence Taylor. I want to get Lawrence Taylor. And we'll go with Will Shields. And we we'll see if we get anything good. And we got this little training collectible. That's actually pretty neat. I'm a big fan about that. So I'll take the Eric Allen put have been really good as well. But you know what? I don't really know exactly who are the new legend. Dan Marino is we definitely going to take um, probably Jason Taylor and Walter Jones. Um, but do we get an elite at the end? No, but okay. I, I ain't complaining. Jason Taylor and Walter Jones. I would take it. I should probably take Eric Campbell for some reason, I think. So we're gonna go with Will Shields and Lawrence Taylor. I'm not sure when Willis Taylor came out, but uh, anyway, these collectible packs are really cool. They're kind of expensive, but you get to choose which collectible you want to get. So obviously I might be able, able to finish Walter Jones. I believe he's a running back. And we're gonna go with Jason Taylor. I don't think I need a defensive end. I think he probably played defensive end. He might even be linebacker in this one. I'm not 100% sure about that. We're gonna check it out. All right, we got four more packs to go. Uh, is that correct? Four more packs to go. We're going with Walter Joan again, and we're going to go with Jason Taylor. A lot of people might be like, get that Marino. And what do we get here? We got one of those um, those power line players. I'll take the power line players. Power line players are always very useful. Ronnie Lott, Walter Joan again. Jason Taylor will go this time. And then we get another collectible. No elites, though. So we haven't really pulled any elites from these packs. So it's kind of like cheese. But... We do have all the collectibles that we will need for the players. So Walter Jones, I, I'm getting, I'm getting Walter Jones every single time. Come on, give me an elite though. All right, so pack luck has not been amazing, but I'm a huge fan of the draft pack for the collectibles. Is oh, we got an elite though. I saw the elite thing on the back. What did we get though? Who do we want to pick off though? Jason Taylor. We're gonna go Jason Taylor. What elite pulls did we get at the? Okay, I'll take Jimmy Ward. I'll take it. I know we saw the elite thingy that popped up at the end, so that meant that we got an elite player. So you can kind of tell if you get an elite almost off the bat. See right now you don't see any of the other ones so lawrence taylor and jason taylor so we're gonna pick those two no elites though but we get the power line player so i will take it and then finally we're gonna open the bundle topper we're gonna open this last one take a screenshot obviously i'm not a huge fan of the card art of toppers they could definitely do it a little bit better but here's the best part we're gonna get three players and we got will shields that's what i'm talking about so there's dan and eric allen so eric allen is an ego player that's why i really liked it but we're definitely not gonna go for um, dan the the offensive tackle we're gonna go with the old guard will shields let's go i was about to build him too but i will take it and he get plus two agility to legend players so that's actually really really sick so we're gonna go see what players we can maybe finish off I'm pretty sure Lawrence Taylor is the old one. I'm like 99% sure Jason Taylor is the new one. Could be vice versa, but I'm not 100% sure which one came out. Walter Jones is the new one. I already knew that one. So I should have close to enough to finish Walter Jones. We were really close. We're going to get a bunch of these random collectibles that we're not going to use right now. Um, I do have a bunch of these legend guns. Dan Marino. I think I didn't, I didn't pull any Dan Marinos. I could have maybe went for Dan Marino, but I'm really fan, big fan of the player that I'm using right now. And it's Marcus Mario. It is Lawrence Taylor. That's what I thought. Lawrence Taylor is the new one. So we have three Lawrence Taylor collectibles. I shouldn't have went with the 
<laughs> Jason Taylor. Jason Taylor is a, probably a little bit older. Um, I think it's one before Earl Campbell, before Eric Allen, Dan Deirdre, Andre Reid, and then it should be Lawrence. Jason Taylor. All right, Jason Taylor. So we're still probably gonna we're, we're, we're kill, very close to kill a uh, kill. Jeez. To kill it, killing is what I meant to say. Walter Jones, who is an offensive tackle, I believe. Why did I think he was a running back? I don't know why I thought he was a running back, but I will take it. We are very close to finishing him off, so we probably will be able to finish him off and get the plus two acceleration, and we're going to have him onto our lineup. He's really good, so I will definitely take those, and that really nice in the end. All right, that's it for today. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Don't forget to let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about these packs. I'm actually a very big fan of them. I like these draft types. It would be great with, like, players, like elite players, like full packs with gold players, elite players. Pick one of them. That'd be really nice. If you want to see my latest videos, give me on the right side of the screen. If you haven't yet, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and make videos on a daily. Alright, I'm out. See you guys next time. Kill it!